Hey guys, it's Sarah from Dundrum and today I'm going to be doing this Katie Contour inspired look on the lovely Sheila. Starting off, I'm just using my 22T brush and my 91 under eye concealer just to create a base on the lid. So now I'm just using my 4SS brush just to kind of buff that into the eye to create a really smooth base. Now I'm just taking my 6SS brush and my 281 shadow and just placing this across the lid and into the crease. Now I'm taking my 46SS brush and shade 18 from the Fabulous Collection and I'm just buffing that into the crease just over the 281 shadow to blend it out. So I'm going back in with my 6SS brush and shadow 282 so this is like a really dark purple plum kind of colour and I'm just placing this onto the lid and into the crease as well keeping it a bit lower than where I placed the 281 shadow. I'm going back in now with my 22T brush and 91 under eye concealer and I'm just using that to cut the crease. Once I have the concealer placed I'm just going to blend it out then a little bit with the 22T brush and just my finger at the very end to create a fade effect. I'm just taking my 9S brush and 54 body sparkles and I'm placing that just on the inner half of the eye. And using the same brush I'm just going to apply 22 AMC pigment just to the centre and then blending it out a tiny bit towards the outer corner. So I'm going back in now with my 282 shadow and just making sure the outer corner is really really blended. So I'm taking my 23T brush and 77 gel liner now and I'm just creating a horizontal line from the inner corner to the outer corner and I'm just going to fill that in as well. And now I'm just using a 13P brush and 63 shadow and I'm just going to pat that onto the very edge just to kind of blend out that gel liner and make sure there's no harsh lines. So now I'm taking the lovely Katie Lash and I'm just applying it to Sheila's lash line using a tweezers and duo glue. So when you're applying lashes just make sure that you're getting the band as close to the lash line as possible so that they blend in with your natural lashes. So now I'm just using my 22T again and some 91 under eye concealer and I'm just going to buff that out underneath the eye with the 4SS brush. applying 77 gel liner into the waterline using my 23T brush and I'm just going to smoke that out then using my 9S brush and some 63 shadow. So I'm just making sure as well that when I'm smoking the 63 shadow into the lash line that I'm blending it into the 77 gel liner and not leaving any gaps. So now I'm just going to take my 281 shadow again and I'm just going to buff that out slightly underneath where I placed the black shadow just to smoke out the bottom lash line even more. So I've already prepped Sheila's skin using the Peach Primer and 69 Illuminator and now I'm just going to blend the 76 HD foundation into the skin using the 38 SS brush. So now I'm taking my 15 BJF brush and press powder number 13 and I'm just going to pop this onto Sheila's face just to set her foundation. So now using the same brush, I'm just going to go in with 30 bronzer all over the face just to warm it up a bit and I'm applying 507 sculpting powder just underneath the cheekbones to contour. So now taking my 4SS brush and 03 sparkling dust, I'm just going to place this on the highest parts of the cheeks, down the centre of the nose, the cupid's bow and the chin, just to highlight. So now I'm taking 854 lip liner, which is a lovely kind of nudey brown colour, and I'm just going to outline Sheila's lips. I'm now going to apply 46 HD lip tint to the lips using my 12S lip brush. So this is one of our liquid lipsticks that goes on like a gloss and then dries matte.
much for watching guys i hope you really enjoyed it and here's the lovely sheila now showing off the finished look don't forget to check us out on instagram as well i've just left our usernames on screen